Do y'all want to be on my vlog? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Last thing I said to you all on the other video, on my first vlog, was that I needed to get a haircut. It was time. So I got one, kept my promise. My wife is really was the advocate, which makes sense, I guess, for the haircut. All right, um, I was gonna try to shoot some video, go outside, find something interesting to do. And it's another day where it's raining, even though I took some dope um, pictures um, even though it started raining and it's up on my Instagram maybe I can drop one on here real quick but I decided one thing I've been trying to learn how to do is b-roll so this vlog episode might just be how to make boring things at home interesting through b-roll Let's see what I can come up with. For me, I guess the significance of the B-roll challenge or a B-roll challenge for myself is that um, I'm learning a lot of the setbacks that I've experienced in the past or, or maybe not so much setbacks, but maybe just um, some lack of advancements that I wanted to see in certain areas, right? Um, potentially have been, not potentially, definitely have been because of laziness. And not laziness in, in meaning that um, I'm not doing hard work or not don't have a job, etc. But even when it comes sometimes to my own creativity, uh, there are certain things that I don't know how to do. I don't necessarily feel like going out there to do it and getting uncomfortable. For instance, um, this isn't so much a, a learning thing, but this was this morning. It was gray outside. It was raining. I didn't really want to uh, wake up, but ended up waking up and uh, early. Got out the house when I did wasn't even really planning on it, and actually got a dope shot faster than I was expecting to the point where I was just like, okay, I, well, I might as well explore with some other things because like I almost immediately got the shot that I wanted, um, you know, and then even with this challenge in myself, if I can't be outdoors, which now it decides it doesn't want to rain anymore, but if I can't be outdoors, then at least saying, how do I make indoors interesting, especially when there isn't much going on inside like the house or something like that, right? So. Uh, I had to go out there and find a way to make it interesting. Um, and so again, it's just a journey of exploration, but you might as well do it. Like this growth comes only from us, us going out there and jumping out there and throwing ourselves out there and seeing what we are able to do. Um, it, this was, I didn't know how to do any of this stuff that I'm like putting up. And I'm, again, I'm not nowhere near the level of half of these other cats out there, okay? But most of these things that I'm doing, I could not do as little as two months ago. Um, I just decided that I wanted to try something new. And th again, this is this is me talking about jumping into photography and videography. But I'm not talking to only photographers and videographers. As a matter of fact, I'm, most of y'all who are photographers and videographers don't need to be talking to me. There's a bunch of other people y'all need to be talking to. Um, so consider. How you doing, sir? So consider, instead of talking about, you know, whatever your lane is, that might be in sports, that lane might be in computer science, that lane might be um, as far as engineering, that lane might be nursing or somewhere in the medical field, that may, lane might be accounting and all that kind of stuff. Challenge yourself to go on out there, jump out there and see what you can do and get done. All right. That's it for me. Average is failure. Create for the creator. Peace.